I just got the new iMac M3 and today I wanted to do a quick test in Final Cut with 4K footage and see how fast it exports. Quick side note, I got this free footage from Pexels.com and they have free stock videos that you can download. I have my clips laid out. As I move the mouse around, it has pretty much no lag, which is so nice. I was using a I believe 2019 iMac before, that was um, Intel, didn't have the M series, so I'm excited to have the M3. Same thing when I hit the play button, plays back very smooth. Something I wanted to try to do is to stack a bunch of this footage together to just see how much footage it can handle. If you hit option G, you can put it into a group, hit command C to copy, command V paste, let's just move it up and just paste it a bunch. Let's see how it plays back. Still the same thing, it's having no problem. That's amazing. You can scroll through. It looks like a little bit laggy, but then again, there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven layers all topped together, and it's all 4K. So it's handling amazing. I also have my settings on better performance. But when you scroll, it looks like it is scrolling with no problem. So now I want to try to add some quick color and color correction to see how it handles. I'll go ahead and add colorize on the first one. Let's add, let's just add a bunch of these to different ones to see how it handles. Every video clip now has a different color on it. Let's hit play and see how it does. And once again, it's playing no problem. That's amazing. And also up here, it's currently rendering it and it still is playing it back at just fine speed. You scroll through, it looks like a little bit of lag, but that's expected with this many layers. So this is over two minutes. Let's see how fast it can export. So hit command E in full, I'll call it iMac M3 test. I'm gonna move this to the desktop and let's see how long it takes to export. Wow, I believe that was less than one minute. So because it was two minutes, let's see what happens. We bring this out to 10 minutes. Okay, so it's now over 11 minutes. Everything's the same, has seven files, and each clip has a color added to it. So let's see how long it takes to export. Wow, 10.87 gigabytes. Let's bring this to H.264. All right, 1.69 gigabytes. Let's go ahead and export it. And we'll replace the file we just made. And there we go, it finished 11 minutes. I believe it took only probably like what, two to three minutes, that's amazing. And remember too, I also have audio recording in the background and screen recording also recording the screen. So it's doing more than just rendering this video. So, so far, I think the M3 is incredible. That's it for this video. I plan on making a lot more content around the M3. If there's anything you'd like to see, like render tests on the M3, please leave a comment in the description below. Please consider commenting, liking, and subscribing as it'll help this channel to grow. And thank you so much for watching.